and to be creative. I, I think we have um, put in place uh, assignments which we do not sort of give you any format. It's up to you to how to creatively come up with the format to present your findings, to present your solutions, to present your ideas across to the, uh, to the lectures. And that hopefully will help you right, in uh, uh, practicing, you know, uh, going to the habit of uh, being creative uh, all the time. Right? Now, uh, I, I think all this you know, we have put in place will not be useful or successful to you if you yourself do not actively participate in it. Right. So we have over the years, over the eleven years, we have students who have gone out and uh, become managers of hotels, start up their own businesses, and some even went on to sort of uh, be Become very successful in uh, the common uh, ministries. Right? We have uh, we have a graduate from the hotel bachelor's program. We are now serving the Ministry of uh, Tourism and hotels in the uh, in the in Mongolia, right? And he's doing really well there. So it's really up to you. So what I, I want all the challenge you you guys today is that you need to find right the right attitude to learn. Okay? And that is and that is very important not only for this period of time but also throughout your life. Because let's like say in the age of disruption, it's lifelong learning. You have to acquire new skills, you have to acquire new relevant skills all the time in the future. And that comes to if you have a good attitude for for learning, I think you make it for life. Right? So they are Singapore is an interesting place. Of course, you know, France is a very advanced country. That's how we actually come from. But Singapore is 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 also a, a, a cosmopolitan city, right? You have people from different culture, different nationalities that actually come to and make it home uh, to themselves. And there are there are a lot of things that's happening here. I feel. Uh, quite unique, right? And we are people who are very adaptive, very adaptive, right? And we adopt things quite easily. And we like to try new things. So there are exciting new ideas that actually comes up actually in the in, in the FMB sector, in the hospitality industry. Every day, right? Just now I talk I talk about two uh, people who actually went on to create their own business right? and they are from uh, one is from Myanmar, the other one is from uh, Sri Lanka, and they have not actually wasted their one or two years here with us. Um, learning is not just within the classrooms in the school, learning can be everywhere outside, outside the classroom. And they observe new things, you know, they observe, they go around trying new things, and uh, you know, uh, one of them actually started up a shisha bar. And that was the first shisha bar in Myanmar. Right, uh, where they come from, and where did, where, where, where did he get the idea? He got the idea from Singapore, okay. and he came to Singapore to buy up all the shisha equipment. But in Singapore, for information, the shisha is shisha bars are banned, and no shisha bars in Singapore. And and it only occurred recently. And when he heard that the shisha bars were banned, he took a flight into Singapore and got up all the old equipment from all the shisha bars who try to sell sell out the uh, their equipment. So there's there's this entrepreneurial spirit in this guy. Right. The second guy was uh, started up started up with a nice small uh, FMP outlet of uh, of interesting stream. Right? And 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 it's a very different concept as what they will find in Sri Lanka. Right? And it's you pick a form and you just take there are three different ingredients, what kind of uh, protein you want, what kind of sauce you want, what kind of uh, carbo you want, you know, just take it. Very simple, but very, very successful right in, in this country now. So, the whole idea is you guys, you adopt a good attitude to learning, and you will be able to get out much, much more from, from this one year or two years that you are going to be in Singapore in this SDH. Okay, so I challenge you, to be to it.
adult the right attitude for learning. Okay. Just now I, I mentioned that there's a there's a lower class, lower level class called the diploma in hospitality operations. Right. And um, there are many students and most of them are from South Asia. So they're Indians, they're Indians. Right. But do you from the TSO class? No. They're all learning. Do you from the TSO class? Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. So you came back. Uh -huh. Okay. So there will be time when you are allowed where you are needed to guide these students because you are going to be the managers and, uh, and uh, professionals for, for, for the industry. And you will, you, you will need to lead people, to manage people, supervise people from different, uh, from different uh, nationalities, lower level. Right? So there will be opportunities where you can actually demonstrate your leadership skills and your managerial skills by organize, helping them organize things, you know, uh, helping with some of the classes that are going on in the digital program. Right? And also there's a student council. We have a student council, I hope you will actively participate in the student council. Right? And not only as you know, volunteer your service as, the, as a member, as a committee member, right? Maybe helping this new counselor if you're not you know, to commit to the time. Just help, help them organize the whole piece. And we have student counselors who've gone through uh, the student council process and we found it extremely enriching, right? Because it provides you an opportunity platform for organizing kind of activities for the students. And this comes very very uh, enriching experience for, for the people themselves, right? So with that, I think uh, I'd like to once again you know, welcome you again to STH and I hope you have a most fruitful time uh, not only with STH but in Singapore and you go back, you know, uh, achieving all that you, you have set up to achieve right, in this one place. Thank you very much. Before I just say you guys more often, right?